Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a lipstick roulette number 5. So as you can tell this is the fifth video in this series so by now you should know what this is all about. If you And if you don't I will have my intro listed here up in the cards as well as in my description, description box. So I also wanted to mention that a few of my friends here on YouTube have also joined in in this project and are doing lipsticks, lipstick roulette. So special mention to Sarah and Kena that also are doing this. I will have them listed in the description box and you should really go and check them out. But let's just get into this round of my lipstick roulette. And I also wanted to mention that I still really really enjoy this product and I'm really really excited about it. And, <laughs> sorry, but I've been back and forth all the time of how often I will do my updates and when I will do them and I've just decided that I'm going to do them every other Monday. Um, I was doing sort of Saturday, Sunday, but now I'm just going to do it every other Monday. So yeah, now you know. <laughs> but let's just get into this week. So let's start with the color that I am wearing right now. And this is the Kiss Me Lipstick in the shade Hotty Toddy. And this is a very warm uh, brown and it's very unique to my collection. Like. I actually haven't worn this these past two weeks like this is the first time that I'm actually wearing it and I will be wearing it all throughout the day I'm going shopping after I'm done filming this but yeah I haven't actually worn it but it's a very unique color so I will definitely keep it in my collection okay and then let's go into some like more lip gloss type uh, products this is the Clarence instant light natural lip perfector in the shade 01 and so this is just a very like light pink lip gloss and yeah it's just it's a nice formula it's very comfortable on the lips this is just a deluxe, deluxe sample like size and i don't think i would purchase the full size of this but i can't say for sure uh, from just like using it a bit this week but i will keep this in my collection then we have the elf luscious liquid lipstick in the shade brownie points and this is just a lip gloss in one of these like twist up tubes and this has a sort of sponge tip here on the top and you sort of twist it and then you get our product and then you just apply it to your lips and this smells really badly and i don't like this foam tip applicator i much prefer if you remember from my last update i had or from a couple if you remember from a couple of videos ago i had this one this is the elf hyper shine gloss in uh, fairy i much prefer this one both the formula and then also the like brush tip i like this one more than i like this like foam tip Thing. So I'm going to declutter this one. And then let's move on to the li lipstick that I've been wearing the most the past couple of weeks or past two weeks. This is the L'Oreal Balmain lipstick in Confession and I love this color. I think it's a super nice like summery, sort of like a warm, very warm peachy nude color but not like a peach nude uh, because those really doesn't suit me but this is just like a peach but sort of still a bit like pinky nudey <laughs> I don't know how to describe it but I really really love this color and I've been wearing this a ton and I will keep wearing it because it's definitely like stunning I had not worn it much before I pulled it into this lipstick roulette uh, because I just I don't know it's just not a color that sort of speaks to me but after like having it in this roulette I will definitely be wearing it a ton because I really really love the color so that's a win <laughs> okay let's move on to a uh, MAC lipstick in full and this is what that one looks like this is just a very pinky nude like a cool tone pinky nude and I know I said last time when I swatched uh, this one compared to the next color I will give a comparison later but I know that I said that those were pretty similar and I know I also said last time that I uh, much prefer blankety uh, over this uh, I will compare them when I get to blankety but uh, I actually really like this for all of the purple looks I do like it's a really nice cool tone pinky like with a bit of nude when I do like purple looks which I do very like 
I know I film a lot in warm looks but like purple looks are my go-to so yeah I will be keeping that one as well so as I mentioned the next one is NARS and audacious lipstick in Anita and as you can see it's like a little it's not a little knob but it's still like knobby but in the swatch they look pretty similar but I, I will put up a comparison pictures of me wearing them because I feel like they look different on the lips like the Anita shade is a lot like warmer and darker compared to faux so yeah hopefully you will be able to tell that in the picture but I will be keeping this one as well as I said in my last uh, when I pulled this I said that I am going to pan this and I think I will uh, some sometime in the near future because I would like to just get a new one this is getting old and uh, I don't want it to go bad so I because this is an expensive wig thing so I would like to just pan this and then probably repurchase and then the last one the in this round is the uh, lime crime pumpkin lipstick and I did wear this in a video recently uh, I think I posted that one but it's a nice orangey sort of red shade is it comes up very red on me I think like I don't know if it's like my complexion but I think it looks very red on me so I do like the color but I sort of wish I want something more orange but I do have a lipstick in my collection like I have two that might be more orange than this one so I will compare those when we get to this but I like Lime Crime Velveteens uh, they are one of my favorite like lipstick a liquid lipstick formula so I will be keeping that one this one okay so those were all of the lipsticks for this round so let's get into the most exciting part and pick the new lipsticks for next round and I'm going to go with seven because I don't know I like seven seven is a good number so whoop, let me just grab my uh, oops. okay so let's pull some lipsticks one Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, probably my worst week yet. <laughs> but okay, let's just go through these and swatch them. So the first one I got is the Nivea lipstick in the shade 81 beige plaisir I think which is a nude that is what that one looks like then we also got an elf lipstick in the shade nostalgic and I'm not sure these are the very really like inexpensive lipsticks and like the packaging is so bad uh, but as I said this is in the shade nostalgic and here is a swatch of that one. It's a super like light nude, very like pinkish. And then we have another one of these luscious liquid lipsticks, but in the shade Strawberry from e.l.f. And this also has this like foam tip. And here is what that one looks like. As I said, in the shade Strawberry. So we'll see how I like this one with the foam tip as well. And then we have the PBG Smoothie Stick. Uh, like creamy lip crayon and I don't think this is I don't think I've ever been able to find like a color on this one but it's like a very sort of sheer very moisturizing creamy lip crayon and then we have the Revlon uh, what are these called ultra HD lipstick in the shade HD sand so it's one of these like twist up and it's a nude here you have sand it's pretty similar to this like Nivea one but yeah uh, I'm excited to wear this one actually and then we have a lip gloss from Colourpop like one of their mini tubes and I have no idea which color this is so and I actually haven't worn this but I'm excited to try it out it's a very like light pinkish nude but I'm sure it won't like sh probably won't show up any color on my lips but I'm excited to try that one out and then the last one is the contour cosmetics liquid lipstick in the shade juju and there you have a swatch of that one so yeah I'm excited to try all of these 
uh, lipsticks out. I am pretty sure that there will be some declutters next round, so keep an eye out for yeah my next update. So yeah, that was everything for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next one. Bye!